Hello and welcome back to Let's Play X to the Threat. Anyway, without further ado, let us continue, shall we? Hmm. Teladi Osprey. I thought we were had like a voice clip. Quantum tube fab. Um, did I to forget to talk to her? No, Elanaco's not there anymore. Um. Oh, okay. There we go. Omicron Lyrae. Omicron Lyrae. Come on. <sighs> Unfortunately, I can't type it like we usually do. Jump device charging at ten percent. And by we normally do, I mean an X three. Yeah, X three. Any other X three. Omicron Lyrae. <laughs> I love my ship, it just looks so cool. So archaic oh, and hiyo, rustic. Hello, Brett. Oh, it seems like I'm the only one who's ready for this bloody fight. Fine. Nah, it's cool. Don't let them Julia, Let them what? Thank God you're here. Oh. You have to see this. We're trying to get a lock on the signal. Oh Next my time goodness. He contacts us, we'll have his exact coordinates. I know it sounds absolutely crazy, but it looks like it's your father. I don't know how, but it seems to be him. It's as if he'd been oh. trying to get in contact with us. Hey, what the? New Kark wave heading our direction. ETA 1 Missouri. We get wave after wave coming from that huge Kark ship. Here they come. All hands to battle station. Julian, Sire, Brett, stick together. Okay, no problem. Wow, you are large. Anyway, it seems that we need a trump card, seeing as how they've got one. So let's bring her in, shall we? Oops. Uh, it would have been more epic if I actually succeeded. Eh. God damn it, I have to press O until I get it. There we go. Welcome in, my trump card. Come on. Anytime now. The Sajuk. Combat uh protect Command me. Accepted. She Boron is Ray. a Boron Ray. A nice little ship. She has a complement of five fighters beneath her. Which if I press that and then that, you'll see. Uh there's the fifth one's gone. Oh, yeah, she doesn't actually own the white thingy. Cat. Um, let us quickly rename this. These are equipped with ion disruptors, by the way. Ah! Alert. Missile closing. We don't have to worry about that at all. There we go. Excellent. I have absolutely no worry about these One little fighters. About. Gonar ship. The one I am worried about Unknown just died. Ship. Never mind. Alert. Missile closing. I'm worried about these destroyers. Alert. Missile honestly. Closing. But yeah, she's a boron um On behalf Ray. of our president and senator. The Argon Federation thank you for your help with this invader. As a reward, you get 500 I think credits. she's about to actually end up shooting. No, you're just gonna dodge? Out of the way of that? Yeah, that's cool. I was going to use it myself, but I didn't like it. I didn't like piloting it. And the only issue with massive capital oh ships no, in this game ship. is the heaviest shield you can actually get is 125 megajoules. So the heaviest shield you can get in the game is not that strong. Target is now in firing range. Hey, if you're looking for a fight, you'll get one. Gamma high energy plasma thrower. Argon Nova. Unknown enemy ship. Come on. We should be able to 
kill you straight. Target is now in firing range. She's equipped with like 12 or so uh, gamma photon pulse cannons. I think it's 6 or so beta? Oh, I can't remember exactly. She's got quite a lot of weapons though. No aim. Needless to say. Oh hey! Unknown object. Unknown enemy ship. No aim. Argon discoverer. Unknown enemy ship. Okay, we can take these out really handily, actually. No aim. Like really Argon handily. Nova. Like I. Th Think that's them all? Nope. Never mind. We have another one. Unknown and unknown enemy ship. They are fast as hell, though. No aim. Unknown enemy ship. <laughs> I love the parts just keep spinning after they die. One more. Let's see that again. Come on. On behalf of our president and senator. The Argon Federation <laughs> thank you for your help with this invader. As a reward, you get 10,000 credits. Yay! <laughs> no one stops the money train. No aim. Oh, I don't Lost think I got that one. Missile. Jeez. Are we just meant to keep Unknown killing these? Enemy ship. I think that might be our capital ship firing that down though. What is that firing? Yeah, there she is. Look at that. Ah, uh, how's she doing in health? She is doing fine for now. No aim. Her shields have held Unknown quite handily. Enemy ship. That's fine. You know what? Sajuk, uh... Navigation... Uh, attack my Command target, please. Accepted. Target is now in firing range. Yeah, you can tell it was the uh, Duke that was doing it, no not aim. me. Unknown enemy ship. Target is now in firing <laughs> That's range. a lot of fires! <laughs> oh no my goodness! Aim. Unknown enemy ship. I need to get a carrier and just outfit it with a crap ton of M4s with high energy plasma throwers or something. I don't remember these no ships being enemy. so quick though. Unknown enemy ship. I seriously think this is all I'm meant to do though. No aim. Unknown enemy ship. Unless maybe I'm meant to talk to Bandana? You are talking to the. Mm. No. Okay. So we're not to talk to Bandana. No Unknown enemy ship. Right. I cannot remember exactly what we're meant to do then. No aim. Unknown enemy ship. <laughs> that was a lot closer no than I wanted to be. Unknown enemy ship. Seriously, is this just that? No aim. Unknown enemy ship. It feels off, but it feels kind of like what I'm meant to do. Target is now in firing range. On behalf of our president and senator, the Argon Federation thank you for your help with this invader. As a reward, you get 10,000 credits. Hmm. Target 
target is now in firing range. No aim. Unknown enemy ship. No aim. Unknown okay. enemy ship. Okay. This is rather anticlimactic, wait. What? <gasps> This one's space dust. Oh, that oh, no, hurt because I ended up hitting one of the mandibles things. They're not really that no deadly. Aim. Unknown enemy ship. It's kind of sad, actually. Target is now in firing range. The grand no finale aim. with the big car. Just enemy turns ship. to this slaughter. Target is now in firing range. I think this is the finale, though. I don't know. I could be wrong. It seems like the finale. One less we have to worry about. Unknown enemy ship. Attention. One of your ships is. Oh my God! Oh. Oh. Goodbye, Colossus. I guess that's what we were waiting for? Or Titan, I think it was. Oh my god, what are those? They're targeting the planet. I've never seen anything like that before. Julian, we've got a lock on Kyle's position. He's on the large mothership in the middle of that laser array. He seems to be alive. We've got to get him out of there, but we can't do it from here. I'll need every single ship of ours to take out those large Kark destroyers. I want you, Sire and Brett, to go in there while we draw the attention on us. You three have to get close to that mothership. If you manage to get to precise positions, you might be able to beam him out of there. I'll mark <laughs> the positions on your screen. Mandana okay. Squadron leaders, concentrate on the large battleships. Attack formation Delta. Now, Julian, go. Unknown enemy. I'm not going to manage it in this. Attention, one of your ships is under attack. Omicron Lyri. I was vaguely thinking it was going to be Gotsunofune. I was like, hmm. One less we have to worry about. I'm not so sure that that's all it is. I have a vague remembrance that we get fired upon. Teladi Osprey. Okay. Um, go after the ship. unknown enemy ships, Ray, please. Like the bigger, the other ones, not that. Unknown enemy ship. There we go. Uh, Sajuk. Um. No, not Dog Hat. Move to position. I've got to be careful. I get don't get zapped by the guys. Uh, move to position, Command roughly there. Accepted. In the meantime, we'll get close. Uh, fly around this big mothership, and that'll be that, I guess. Unknown enemy ship. Any ideas on it? No inform Stop. Stop them. You have to. Stop. That's okay. We We're on the way. We're off your back as good as we can. Try to get closer to the mothership, but be careful of those lasers. You won't survive getting hit by one of those. Oh, especially not in this. We're taking heavy fire, but I think we can make it. Got you back. Wait, what? Oh, okay. Good. Start taking your positions. You should see the marks on your display. I was there, basically. Why are you doing that? Ah, uh, whatever. Navigation. <laughs> 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 you dicks! You absolute dicks! Good thing I recovered that. Jeez. There. Almost there. Oh god, hey. Okay, I'm in Same here. I 
I'm in position. I'm activating the beam array now. Everyone stay in position or we'll lose focus. I'm having trouble holding my position. Oh my god, do you see that? Looks like that thing's gonna shoot any Caesura now. Hold on. Starting the beam sequence now. It's working. We've almost got him out. I think we've got him. Only a few... Wait a Caesura, what's happening? All of a sudden, all the cog ships seem to have lost their orientation. Huh. Those lasers. They stopped firing. Oh no, we're losing him. <laughs> I can't hold the beam field. It's collapsing. I can't let this happen. No, 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 no. Damn! Too late. They got him back. Break your formation. Get back to safe distance. Oh my god. The cock are back in the game. They're charging that laser up again. Pull back. Yeah. It missed the planet. That was close. Jeez, how did you miss a planet, you no crabby? End. Don't let it happen. Our scientists got an idea why it didn't work. I don't have time to go into details, but they also made out some weak spots. If you take out the marked targets, we may have a chance of beaming Brennan out of there. Don't want to interrupt, but did anyone else see that too? It almost looked like Brennan was controlling the entire Kark fleet. I mean, it looked like all the Kark ships lost their objective when we tried to get him out of the mothership. Maybe Brennan is somehow connected to the Kark brains or commando system or whatever. If we're able to get him out, we might be able to stop the mothership from firing that large laser array again. Indeed. Sire is right, and I don't think they'll miss a second time. If they hit the planet with that thing, the explosion would kill billions of innocent people. Hmm. And as close as we are, I think the shockwave would kill everything in this sector as well. We can't let that happen. I've marked the targets you have to take out before we try again. Hurry up. If our scientists are right, and they have to recharge the mothership completely to fire again, we have very little time left. Affirmative. We'll do our best. Weapon systems online and ready to be used. Unknown object. Well, point out the weak spots. You have to. Do it. Um. There's no other way. Do it. Hurry. Command accepted. Right. Um. Now we've got that ship coming out and following me, I'm going to teleport over to... I don't have the ability. Well, I've got another idea. Uh, come on. Right, excellent. We've got three Alpha High Energy Plasma Throwers. That'll do. Unknown enemy ship. Right, uh, unknown objects. Unknown object. Right, come on. Uh, whereabouts are they? Are they just sitting in the exterior? If so, this shouldn't be too hard. Target is now in firing range. This one's space dust. Excellent. Unknown <coughs> object. I thought there was fares. On behalf of our president and senator, the mm. Argon Federation thank you for your help with this invader. Come on. Excellent. This one's space dust. Unknown object. This is surprisingly a lot easier than I thought it would be, honestly. <laughs> like, are my friends just we have to worry about like stopping it? Unknown object. Okay, come on. One less we have to worry about. Unknown object. Unknown object. I don't think we're hitting that one actually. Target left fire. That's range. fine. Unknown enemy ship. Unknown enemy ship. 
No, we need the unknown, unknown object. object. Okay, there we go. Unknown object. Come on. Ah, oh, you're kidding. <coughs> Fine, I think diving attacks are probably better. Target left firing range. Target is now in firing range. Actually, no. Didn't go too well. Right, come on. Okay, we'll go against Target the green instead then. Firing range. It can be a bit tricky because it's continuously rotating. Target is now in firing range. Right, stop moving. Come on. I should do it. One less we have to worry about. Alert. Whoa, hey, they're angry. Alert. Missile close <coughs> alert. Missile closing. Unknown object. Unknown enemy ship. Come on, we'll just fly around the ship for a little bit. Uh, never think about it. Um, the discoverer's gone! <laughs> I was about to say I'll just park that discoverer, but no, it's dead. Uh, that's fine, I guess. Can. Alert. Refit another one. Ah, right, come on. Getting this other object. Ah, no. Alert. Missile closing. Boron ray. Right, we Alert. need to get. We need to get Missile back onto closing. this a juke. Docking computer <gasps> not installed. Oh, you got to be kidding me! Really? Uh, combat. Protect me. Command accepted. You don't have to move while doing it, though. Docking aborted. No, fine then. Unknown enemy ship. Alert. Missile closing. Come on. Uh, we have to worry about. That is not what I wanted. Bloody Unknown enemy frame rate. You would not believe how much harder it is to dogfight with this frame rate. Ugh. Right. And Excellent. Alert. Missile <coughs> closing. Right, we need to get back to heart. Where is it? Alert. Missile closing. Uh, Ray, help! Help! Help us! Help! Ray, stop moving so quick. Fine, we'll move towards you. Shields, critic, boron, ray. No! No! <laughs> Fine, I've got one more idea that should work. Ah, oh, box! <laughs> that went so horribly. Ah. And now the sound's gonna be off, so I'll be back in a second while I fix that. Okay, now I think about it, I've got another idea and I have no idea why I didn't just do this in the first place. It'll make sense after the first Stop. section. Stop them. <sighs> you have to. Stop. That's fine, we'll get we're to it. Them off your back as good as we can. As Try well as we can. Well. to the mothership, but be careful of those lasers. You won't survive getting hit by one of those. Well, I think you may be surprised with this. Fire, but I, think we can make it. I think Talon could, you, you know, survive quite easily. Anyway, we've seen the cutscene, so... Beacon. Give the navigational beacon again. Ah... Uh, seriously, where is the navigational beacon? Navigational there we go. Beacon. 
Almost there. Almost there. Hang on. Okay, I'm in. Same here. Right. Moving into position now. I'm in position. Same. A little faster. That's cool. The beam array now. Anyway, we've seen that again. Our scientists got an idea why it didn't work. I don't have time to go into details, but they also made out some weak spots. If you take out the marked targets, we may have a chance of beaming Brennan out of there. Someone you know how I should have done this? See that too? Ah. Like Brennan was controlling the entire car. Give us a second. It looked like all the car ships lost oh, wait. their objective. We already do tried to get him out of the mothership. Oh, we can oh, already no. do it. Maybe well, I'll let them fall first. To the brains or commando system or whatever. But yeah, there's a way that I could have done this. That would have been so much more intelligent. From firing that large laser array again. Sire is right, and I don't think they'll miss a second time. If they hit the planet with that thing, the explosion would kill billions of innocent people. And as close as we are, I think the shockwave would kill everything in this sector as well. We can't let that happen. I've marked the targets you have to take hey. out before we Oh, you're firing again. at my boron. Hurry up. If our scientists are right, and they have to recharge the mothership completely to fire again, we have very little time left. Attention. One of your ships ah, is under that's fine. attack. Omicron Lyrie. Anyway, the best way that I can think of yes. doing this. No. Don't know why I didn't think of this the first time round. I'm I'm so sorry. Attention. On behalf of our president, I mean, it takes a bit longer, but you know, I'm smacking them all at the same time. One less we have to worry about. Target is now in firing range. This one's space dust. Alert, missile closing. Alert, missile closing. I mean, it's a less damage overall, but look on at this. On behalf of our president and senator, the Argon Federation, thank you for your help with this invader. This one's space. This one's what? space dust. On behalf of our president and sen. That should do it. Return to your positions near the mothership. We have to do this far. All right, taking my position again. On my way. My shields are damaged, but I think I can make it. This doesn't look good. Our experts are sure it's about to fire any Mizora now. <laughs> dun dun dun! That much time. I can't hold any longer. Attention. One of your ships is under. Oh god, hey. Omicron Lyrie. Unknown enemy. What? I didn't see any. Take un unknown. Un unknown enemy ship. Ah. Damn it, come on. Guys, you've got to get into position now. The scientists here told me the mothership is targeting exactly on the planet this time. This won't be a miss. That's fine. Okay, <coughs> I think I've got it. I'm ready. Holding my position. Okay, I'm in now. Go, go, go. Beam! <laughs> Beam! <laughs> Activating beam sequence. Charging. Oh, I remember how tense this used to be. Beam process looks good. Still quite tense. Oh my god. I think the mothership is about to shoot. Look. We have to make it. Looks good from here. If this works, we'll have him out before that thing can fire. Excellent. Has anyone noticed that generator down there near the beam? It started glowing the moment we activated the beam sequence. You're right. It's blocking off the beam rays. Oh no, we're gonna lose him again. We can't. There are billions of people that are going to die if we lose him. I can't hold him much longer. Joel, sire, keep your positions. You can make it. I'll take care of that generator. No, Brett. I'm losing him again. Brett, you can't do it. What are you doing? Get back to your position. Goodbye, you two. Promise me to take care of each other. No, Brad. No, no, don't do it. <laughs> no, Brad. We got him. We've got Kyle. <laughs> oh. It's going to implode. Implode? That's exploding. Get away from the mothership. It's overloading. 
That's clearly exploding! Shields are down. Oh, you'll be fine. Oh, wait, what? Oh! Sire? Sire, please come in. Sire? Sire, do you read? You must be fine. Thank God, I'm getting a life sign. Looks like she made it out of her ship in time. I'll have a beam to the sick bay on my ship immediately. I'm sorry for what happened to Brett. I know this doesn't help right now, but remember that he saved us all. <laughs> remember Sorry, the Julian, ones that I are have lost. To jump back to Argon Prime immediately. We'll lose your father if we don't get him to a hospital right away. I'll contact you as soon as I can. See you soon, Julian. Bandana to squadron leaders, take out all the remaining Kark ships while they're inactive. Destroy every last one of them. Show them that we are still standing. Dana out. Boron, Argon, unknown enemy ship. They're not very Dana, inactive, Dana, really. High energy but, you know. Thrower installed. I don't think they are, anyway. Target is now in firing range. No, they On still have fire of weapons. And Senator, at least. The Argon Federation, thank you for your help with this invader. Command accepted. Ah, uh, just follow me. Actually, you know what? Uh, Command have fun. Unknown enemy yeah, ship. we've not really got anything to worry about here. No honestly. Free Argon trading station. Uh, you know what? I might as well just let her tidy it up. The Sajuk tidy it up while I make my way back to uh, nowhere because I need energy cells. God damn it. Um... Right. Energy cells. Uh, grab as many Four. energy cells as you can. Uh, navigation, jump to. Uh, might be easier if I just go J, uh, G, and then like that. Uh, jump to the north gate, please. I'll also jump to the north gate. North gate to make it easier. Oops. Jump device charging. And then we'll go back to Omicron Lyri, talk to Bandana, see what the situation is on our father. Entering system, Omicron Lyri. Uh, that's fine, we should be in range, excellent. Um, we can take that 3 oh, ore. Transferred. And we will take 1000 energy cells. Energy so yeah, transferred. I went and had a look at all the destroyers, see which one I thought was the best, and that's essentially the one that stuck out for me. Anyway, I collect Command everywhere accepted. in here, please. Uh, we'll go to see. Well, that's close enough. Omicron Lyrie. Nope, not Omicron Lyrie. Argon Prime. Jump device charging at. And 10%. yeah. Entering system, Argon Prime. Um, where are you? There you are. Argon One. Ah, uh, you know what? Just make this a little bit quicker. Teladi Osprey, command accepted. You follow me. And we'll go and talk to you, Mr. Ban. Argon One. You are talking to the... Uh, bandana. Or you can just completely ignore me. Okay, well, I will bring you back in a second when we get both messages. I know there's messages coming up, that's why I'm saying that. So, I'll see you in a moment when we get the first one. So, see you in a bit. There we go, we got the first message. Julian, I've not even had time to tell you how excellently you've helped us. Simply outstanding. I brought your father and sire down to Argon Prime. They're receiving the best possible medical attention. Sire got away with some bruises and some minor craniocerebral injuries. Mm -hmm. They want to keep her at the hospital for a few tazuras, but she'll be fine. I'm afraid I can't say the same about your father. The doctors have been able to treat all of his severe wounds, but he's still in some sort of a coma. Nobody knows when and if he's going to wake up. All we can do now 
is pray for him. I have to tell you again how sorry I am for what happened to Brett. But it seems that his death was not in vain after all. We got your father back. And more important, it looks like we also fought back the Kark. We still don't understand what happened when we pulled him out, but somehow they must have used him to coordinate their attacks. I hope it will take them a long time to recover from their defeat. Maybe at least enough time for us to figure out why they attacked us, or why they use your father. There are a lot of questions to be answered, but I'm afraid only time will tell. Anyway, I want you to know that we are holding a ceremony for your lost friend. Meet me in Sector Argon Prime, on board the Argon One. We'll wait with the ceremony until you arrive. See you there, Julian. Hi, I'm already here, Bandana, but alas, the sentiment is still nice. <laughs> you know what, Osprey? Uh, just sit there. That's fine. You're, 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 you're fine. You can stay there. Argon Mercury. Before you scare the crap out of me. Uh, right. Anyway, Argon One. Argon One. Just in case anything goes wrong, I'm just gonna save it here. May as well. I mean, this is probably the last I'm going to be in this universe for a while. May as well just save it as often as I can right now. And by this universe, I just mean this game is in this game. I really do feel like playing X3 quite soon, so to the I'm probably going to play system. it immediately after Make this. Your request. Ah, Rev Quest, a call with a person on board, a bandana. Julian, I'm glad you could come. Please dock with the Argon One. We'll be waiting with the ceremony until you arrive. I have someone here eager to see you. Ah, Eleanor Cole, I guess. Da, ba, ba. But yeah, Eleanor Cole plays a vital part later on, so yeah, that's why I was like, nah, she couldn't have died, could she? It doesn't make sense. Uh, Eleanor Cole, oh, goddammit, Saya Cole plays an important part later on. I find it so weird the way that the Argon one is designed. Huh. Interesting. Where are we going? <laughs> We've gathered here today to say goodbye to a friend. And not only a friend, but also a hero. A hero who saved many lives in an unequaled and utterly selfless act. Knowing that by giving his life, he would save billions, he earned himself a place amongst those that shall remain forever <laughs> in the hearts of his friends, in the hearts of those whose lives he saved, and in the hearts of those that will come after him. He might be gone now, but he will go on living because billions of people will remember him forever. Well, forever is a stretch, but yeah. He will be remembered for longer than many people live. For longer than many people live. So he will be remembered for a pretty damn long time. But forever is not likely, to say at least. Call me a cynic if you want, but you know. No wingman available. Oops. Yes, her wingman died. Incoming oh. message. Anyway, Jules, I have always uh, been. <laughs> Jules, you have always been the better part of me, my friend. Deep down, I've known all along that such a time like this would come. Ever since Ban explained to me how you and your father were key to the survival against the Kach. I have been asked, I have asked Ban to give you this and and the eventuality that I am lost. I am so good at reading. Your thoughts may be dark, but I ask only that you take care of Saya and build strength into everything your father has fought for all these Yazuras. You uh, will need to be strong, very strong, to fight what lies ahead of you. Do not underestimate uh, your need for a strong base of fighters or stations. You can never have too much firepower, Julian. I think you know that. Cahoon, Julian. See you on the other side of the jump gate. Brett. 
<sighs> so yeah. Anyway, I don't think that's the end. I think we have one more message. So, I will see you in a second when we get that message as well. So, see you in a moment. Okay, welcome back. We have our final message as far as I remember. So, Julian, I know this must be hard for you to get... To, uh, blah, 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 blah. Julian, I know it must be hard for you to get your father back, but uh, not to be able to talk to him. I'm sorry, but I have good news for you. I have no good news for you. Why is my gun so far? Oh, whatever. He is uh, still in a coma, and we still do not know what caused it. However, I tell I want to tell you that we are going to search for a cure or a way to bring him back. Now he is safe and with us. This is only a matter of time till we can help him. I will contact you as soon as we find something to help him. Godspeed, Julian. Godspeed in all your ways. And with that, I think that is the final message we actually get. And the final part of this whole story. But it took 4 days, 12 hours, and 44 minutes in real time. And game time? Um, I don't know exactly. I'm trying to think. Uh, 60 times 10 seconds would be uh, 600 seconds. So... 10 minutes per uh, hour. I think, maybe? If we sped it up completely and always had it at full speed. So ten or ten minutes per hour, I guess, if it was at full speed. So I would say roughly an hour would be approximately about an hour and a half to two hours, minimum. Yeah, I don't know exactly, but anyway, I will leave it there. So until next time, all the best, and I hope you enjoyed. What I will do is I will also read the booklet because it has some interesting information. Uh, if you don't want to watch that, then feel free, and I'll see you next three, uh, reunion. If you do feel like watching it, then, yeah, I'll see you there. So, until next time, all the best, and I hope you enjoyed.